Hello and welcome to Projects Using Angular 2 by Eduonix. My name is Brad Traversy and I'll be your instructor for this course. So before we get started, just a little bit of information about myself. I've been a web developer for around 12 years or so. And for four of those years, I've been creating and teaching web development courses. I specialize in many different JavaScript technologies such as Angular, Node.js, React.js, and some other some of the other popular JavaScript frameworks and I also work with PHP a lot and server-side development I do have dozens of courses available at eduonics.com if you're interested so let's take a look at what this course will consist of so you'll be learning the angular 2 framework front to back in not one or five or even ten projects we're going to be building 12 different projects, 12 different applications using Angular 2 and other technologies. All right, so 12 sections, 12 projects. Each section will have between 6 and 10 lectures, and then each lecture will have one to two videos along with a short quiz and whatever project files go with that lecture. So what you should know before taking this course, you should definitely know HTML and CSS. Uh, also some basic JavaScript and then some programming fundamentals including things like variables, conditionals, loops and so on. Uh, some of the technologies that can really help you but are not required is Angular, of course Angular 2, uh, Angular 1, even though Angular 2 is much different it can still help you a little bit, uh, Node.js and then any other J JavaScript frameworks that are, are similar to Angular 2, such as React.js. So even though this course is on Angular 2, we'll be using quite a bit of other popular technologies. So here's a list of some of those technologies. Obviously, HTML, CSS, JavaScript, uh, Angular, uh, Node.js, Meteor.js, which is a JavaScript platform that works in the front and back end. Socket.io, which gives us uh, real-time bi-directional communication between a client and server. Express.js, which is a, a Node.js-based web framework. MongoDB, which is a NoSQL database. Firebase, which is a remote uh, NoSQL database. Ionic 2 is a mobile platform that uses Angular 2. We'll be working with the Angular 2 Quick Start as well as the CLI. Uh, Google Maps, some of the other APIs we'll be working with, GitHub, Spotify, Weather Underground, um, the mean stack, which is MongoDB, Express, Angular, and Node, and then Feathers.js, which is a back-end platform for building APIs. All right, so these are just some of the, the, the technologies and concepts we'll be working with. So now let's take a quick look at what kind of projects we'll be building. So the first project will be very simple. It's an int introductory level project to basically explain how to set up Angular 2 applications and we'll cover all the fundamentals. Then we'll build a GitHub profile search. This will allow us to search GitHub profiles using the public API. Uh, NG Spotify will be building a, an artist, a musician lookup application using the Spotify API. Mean To Do's, a To Do's app using MongoDB Express, Angular, and Node.js. Firebase Business Listings, this will uh, be an application where we can add and manage different businesses and store the data in Firebase. My Workouts will be an Ionic 2 mobile app for tracking workouts. We'll have My Weather, which will be another Ionic 2 mobile app that tracks worldwide weather. WebMarks will be an application that uses both Angular and Meteor.js to track bookmarked websites. MapIt will be an Angular 2 app that integrates Google Maps and allows you to mark points on a map and manage them. Movie Finder will be a movie directory using the, the moviedb.org JSON API. DevLogger will be uh, a simple logging application that uses Feathers.js and a RESTful API. And then Socket Chat will be a real-time chat application using Socket.io. All right, so that's what's in store in this course. There's quite a bit to cover, so I will see you in the next video. Hello, and welcome to the Projects Using AngularJS course by Eduonix. 
My name is Brad Traversy and I'll be the instructor for this course. I just want to quickly go over what's included. All right, so in this course, you'll learn all about the AngularJS JavaScript framework and how to build dynamic web applications. There will be 10 chapters. Each project, I'm sorry, each chapter has four to Hello and welcome to the Eduonix Angular 2 course. My name is Brad Traversy and I'll be your instructor through the course. So I just want to go through a quick introduction of what we'll be doing here. So this course will be focusing on all the core fundamentals of Angular 2, which is a full job JavaScript framework for building web applications. So this course will include slides, examples, as well as a complete project at the end.